Hi, you're awake. Wait, please, I... I am so, so sorry about this. I know I'm kind of uh, pinning you down right now, but I promise I'm not dangerous and I'm not gonna hurt you. I just need you to listen, okay? What am I doing in your room? That is such a good question. Um, this really isn't how I wanted us to meet. I just, I've missed you. You haven't left your apartment in days and you've been closing the blinds at night. Since you work from home, you basically don't have a regular routine, so it's tough to know when you'll come outside. I really wanted to see you. Because... I love you. It's okay. You don't have to say it back or anything. I know you just met me, and this situation is a little scary. The security in this building is really awful, by the way. Literally anybody could break in. If nothing else, you really should put the chain on. Good, I'm glad you'll make it a habit from now on. The first time I saw you, we were at the grocery store. You were just so beautiful. I was way too shy to introduce myself, but I was scared I would never see you again. So I followed you home. I know I shouldn't have, but I just couldn't resist. Why didn't I ask you out? I couldn't. I... You would have said yes? Really? You're not just saying that because I broke into your apartment and you think I might be dangerous? You think I'm cute? Yeah, I guess it would be hard for you to meet someone. Not because there's anything wrong with you, you just don't get out much. Honestly, I didn't think you would like me like that. I was so jealous when I first started watching you. Every time you checked your phone, I wondered who you were talking to. If you loved them. If they deserved it. How could they? Who could ever be good enough? But after a while, I realized that you don't have anyone like that. You don't really have anyone at all, do you? You live alone. You have a couple of friends, but you don't see them often. Your family is far away. Sometimes you shut yourself off and ignore everyone's texts. If you disappeared, how long would it take before anyone would notice? Oh, no, sorry, I promise I'm not gonna steal you away or anything. Unless you want me to, you could quit your job. Leave behind everyone who doesn't appreciate you. Get out of your empty apartment. I could take care of you. Uh, or not. I mean, we just met. I understand if you want to get to know me more first. No rush, right? You can always reconsider in a couple of years, or six months, or next week. Whenever you're ready. You know, I kind of like that you're a loner. I've never liked sharing my things. Uh, that came out wrong. I know you're not a thing. It's just nice knowing you won't be pulled away from me too much. If I stop holding you down, are you going to attack me or call the cops or something? Actually, no, don't answer that. I understand if you do. I probably have it coming. Okay, I'm just going to get my knees off your arms, and then I'll sort of... Oh! You're hugging me. Can I... Cool. Let me know if this is too tight, okay? Yeah, it's... Been a while since I've been hugged, too. <sighs> you smell amazing. I'm not talking about your soap or your shampoo. I'm talking about you. I started buying the same products, but it's just not the same. Why do I know your scent so well, even though you've never seen me before? This might not be the first time I broke in. Please relax. It's okay, really. And even if it isn't okay, we can't resolve it tonight. It's late, and I know I woke you up. You must be so tired. Do you still want to cuddle?
about as close to a classic Yandere audio as I think we're ever going to get. <laughs> 